Now, we've just stumbled upon a little jackpot. It's a very well camouflaged jackpot, but it is one of the most awesome, awesome little cats. It's called a serval. It has just kind of lowered itself in the grass. And there now you can see its head a little bit easier. It's got very distinctive white bars on the back of its ears, which I absolutely love. And let's hope that it kind of just stands up and keeps moving. And I'm hoping it's going to be relaxed and hopefully we can spend some time with it. They're great hunters and they use those massive ears that you can see to help detect their prey, often small rodents in the grass. And they've got a great ability to be able to pounce high into there, landing down on top of their prey. <coughs> Wee! Blessings, excusings. Ah. <laughs> Sorry if that sneeze took you guys by surprise. I did my best to try and hold it in. That probably had a worse effect than just releasing it. Let me see if I can reverse a little bit. I stopped as soon as I saw it, so possibly not in the most favorable position. And what I'm actually going to do is I'm just going to skirt a little bit off the road here. Just assess whether it is going to be relaxed with us or not. If not, we will keep a distance and leave it be. If it is, well, then we're in some major, major luck. So far, it seems good. It hasn't flinched. Let's just stop here and bank some good views of it. Oh, perfect. I think it's hunting. I'm not sure it's hiding from us. It seems focused on something in the grass ahead of it. Now, it's quite a small cat to give you an idea of its size. It's probably the size of a large house cat. But it's got very, very long legs. Oh, they are so, so awesome. Huh. What is it going to do next? Hello to Ellie. This is apparently the first serval you've seen, and I am hugely, hugely happy to hear that you have seen one, because I'm sure you agree they are absolutely beautiful creatures, and one that we don't see that often. Let's keep moving. What a bonus. Lions with James, serval with me. Byron's apparently also found some more cats, so we are certainly getting very lucky. to my lens you would like to know how big is the serval population in the mara and i don't have a clue on exact numbers and i'm sure that nobody really does but what i can assure you is that there are many many serval so it's one of the best places i've ever worked where you can see serval it must be quite close to us now so i'm just going to go very slowly Sorry, little serval. Now, let's see if it doesn't pop out again. Here it is, just on the right of the bush there, Darby. Oh, they are the best of creatures. Look at that markings, or those markings. And again, those white bars on the back of its ear are so awesome. I'm wondering if they kind of not like a fake eye, so it looks like... Regardless of which direction it's facing, it is keeping an eye on both its front side and its back side. Absolutely awesome. So, I'm thinking... Let's try and get one more view. I really don't want to disturb it too much. And... Even though it jumped out of the grass there and made some distance, I don't think it's hugely terrified and like a lot of animals just with a little bit of time spent they'll slowly become relaxed with the vehicle especially the lesser known stars of the african wilderness that get a little bit less 
Vehicle time. Okay, it sounds like James is in a good spot with his line, so why don't you shoot back to him? 